everybody, it's Blue Ducky, and I'm pretty excited to have a new Monster High Frightmares reviews for you. I have Skyra, Bounsky, and Pana. Pana. <laughs> I like her name. I want to say Penelope, um, but it looks more like Penny Pole Steam Tail. I'm sure I'm saying that wrong. Let me get you know. Let me know down in the comments below how you would pronounce her name. Um, but they are the wave two of Frightmares, and I got these two off of Amazon.com. So if you're interested, go check out Amazon. Here's a closer look at Penny Poles. Uh, like I said, I know I, you guys are probably gonna be yelling at me in the comments. That's not how you say it, but um. Closer look at the front of her box. So she is a steampunk unicorn frightmare, which is really, really cool. I adore her artwork and the fact she has glasses. And here's a look at the back of her box. Again, I love the artwork for these frightmares. I think they look really cute. And it says, Penapole Steamtail. I'm a finely tuned Frightmare who's geared to trot like a top. I believe precision makes the world go round and that includes getting my name right. It's Penne <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. Penne Pole or Penelope or whatever. Please pronounce it precisely. That right there doesn't tell me really how to pronounce your name at all. Here's a close-up look at her face. She has a dark plum lipstick and a little bit of purple around her eyes, eyeshadow. Like I said before, I really do love that she comes with glasses and she got these beautiful emerald green eyes. I do have to admit the placement of her unicorn horn on her head bothers me because it's like, it's just on this particular Frightmare. I don't know if I got one that was like really odd or what, but it's not like in the center of her head really and it's it's too far back for my liking and it kind of is sideways so it just looks like kind of an accidental horn just grew out of nowhere. Hairstyle, she has these blunt bangs in the front. And her hair is this purple with a little bit of lighter purple streaks through it. Um, and in the back, it's nice and straight and long and silky. Here's a look at the back of her hair so you can see how long her hair is. And the color of it. It's a really unique shade of purple and I like it. On her back, she has a pair of steampunk butterfly wings in a gold color. You can see all the gears and cogs on her wings make it really cool looking for her shirt it's painted on teal shirt almost a corset with the belt in the front and little cogs and gears painted on she has a lime green belt that is made up of chains and mechanical gears and she also has a hoof um a horseshoe on the front of her belt. Her horse body is a purple color and on the front of her legs she has two uh, leg warmers in a steampunk style. They're a teal color but they're decorated with different gears and swirls and bolts. And then on her hind leg her little uh, Frightmare mark is um, gold and it has different swirl designs as well as mechanical gears and for her tail it is a plastic tail like the previous um, wave one of Frightmares it has a purple color and it looks like wavy uh, you know a wavy tail horse tail I would say the color for body I thought it was purple but I guess it's more like a maroon color Okay, next I want to take a look at Skyra Bouncegate, who looks really, really cool. And this is the front of her box. You can enjoy her artwork. And then here is the back of her box, where it says, I've been accused of being perky, but I prefer to think of myself as energetic. And it's a good thing, too, because it takes a lot of energy to cheer on the herd, encourage them, go fight, win. 
an up close look at Skyra's face. She has blue lips and then sort of a ghostly blue light eyes. And then protruding out of her head is two uh, horns, two Frightmare horns in the light blue skin tone. And then looking at her hair, which is styled into two piggy tails. I really love the color of her hair. It's a mix of light and darker blue and then purple throughout it. Here's a look at her hair from the back, which this part, this blue and light blue part, reminds me of Gulia's hair color. Going down into her outfit, she has a painted on cheerleader top, is white with a blue horseshoe and then a teal and blue stripe and around her waist is some silver chains because if you guys hadn't guessed it already she's kind of like a ghostly cheerleader frightmare and with Monster High all ghosts has, seems have to have these chain kind of belts so it's a silver chain belt and there is like um balls at the end of most of the chains but then one has a little silver horseshoe and then underneath that is a blue skirt her frightmare body is pretty awesome it's this white pearly color that shimmers purple in the light and then when you go down to her hoofs it's a metallic silver gradient that makes her silver hoofs and is really pretty on her front two legs she has these leg warmers that look like shoes and then there's a pom-pom at the end and then for her Frightmare mark it's kind of hard to see this is covering it a little bit let's try and move that away uh, there is a bullhorn which is very fitting for her cheerleader personality and then she has little stars uh, in a purple color decorating down her leg and a little bit on her back. She has a light blue bow around her tail and her tail is a blue color and it is straight. Of course it is made out of plastic. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching this Wave 2 Frightmare unboxing and review. Um, out of the two, which one is your favorite? I think my favorite, personally, is Skyra. I like her color scheme and details a little more than I like, um, <laughs> Penelope, or however you say it, Penelope. <laughs> You let me know. I'm sure you will. I do like that she's a unicorn. It, I don't like the play, the way her horn is on her head, but I do like her glasses. So yeah, thank you guys again for watching. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and share it with your friends. I really do appreciate it. If you happen to be a new viewer, make sure to hit that subscribe button to keep up to date on all my toy videos. And I'll see you guys later. Have a great day. Bye.